My name's Andy Hockley, and I am the current Monsieur Fearman in front of the opera here at Her Majesty's Theatre. And I'm Martin Ball, and I am the other current theatre manager, Gilles André. I think Monsieur Fearman is as uncomfortable in the theatre as, as André. I've started again, I got us wrong on one like <laughs> As Andre is comfortable in that he's, Fearman's much happier in an office, behind a ledger, um, sorting out figures and all the business side of things. And Andre couldn't be happier than being amongst the arts and the actual people and the beautiful music and um, being, being, being hands on with all that sort of thing. Very, very happy. So when I'm a fish in water, he's a fish out of water, and yeah. vice versa, probably. For that to work, it really, we have to not find it comedic at all. There's a terrific um, amount of comedy in, in Still Goes, it's a terrific, terrific amount of wit in, in Still Goes lyrics in, in those letters that the Phantom has sent, and all the internal rhymes in those, all that sort of wordplay. But that only really works if, that, if we take that very seriously, don't you agree? Absolutely. We, we, they're very amusing, the lyrics, very witty, but we mustn't find them amus amusing and witty at all. They're telling our story, and the lovely thing about our story is that the audience are in a very privileged position from the beginning, is that they know more about the Phantom than we ever do. And so it's, our, it's the, cir the circumstance that we're in that the audience find funny as opposed to us trying to play yeah. with where funny characters bring in light relief to the piece. Yeah, well I love working with the other people. No, seriously, we don't. We got on from day one really, didn't yeah, we? Really because did, yeah. we were told by everybody that we would. <laughs> <laughs> but everybody's been so welcoming. I mean a lot of the younger members of the cast here will only have done, apart from understudies, but the, the principal roles will only have been played by the previous incumbents, of course, who were here for five years. Um, we, we will be a completely different experience for them, um, but the building couldn't have been more welcome. No, it's a really, it's famously, Phantom has always been, Hermes has always been a very happy building. That's been true for 25 years. I'm not quite sure why, um, but, um, but it's, it's, it's true. And uh, despite the change of personnel over the years, it's remained so. I've known people you know, who've been here you know, for 25 years. And lots of friends have come in and out over the years, and they've always said what a happy building it is. And, and, and it's true, they're a very welcoming crowd, um, and it's got a and that's family across the board as well. You know, like cleaners, front of house staff, mm. everybody. I think I think there's a a kind of pride in the show, yep. and and a deep rooted respect for the fact that this piece of theatre has lasted for as long as it has in yep. one home, and yep. people respect that and and. And I'm proud, to be, I'm proud to be part yeah. of it. Yeah. Curiously, we decided, didn't we, last night? We decided between the two of us that it was masquerade, that even though it contains dance dancing. and movement is not what we've been employed for. No, let's hope. Um, but it's, and one of the reasons is that the, the whole company is the only time we're all company together on Because we have our own little gang, which is all very well, but it's just the sort of four or five or six of us, and often just the pair of us. And it's just lovely to, actually my favourite of the show is just before the curtain goes up on Masquerade, where we actually get to chat with the rest of the company. Yeah. Um, and, and those costumes, you never tire. I mean, every time I look at them, I see a new detail. They are stunning, stunning and costumes. The, there's also enough freedom within the, the piece, to when, when we're not required, when the proper dancers are taking the yeah. full stage, yeah. and we wander up onto the stairs. That's actually the first time I get to speak to some members of the cast yeah, and the only of time. an evening. Yeah. And yeah, the only time that I speak yeah. to them. Yeah. So it's nice just to be all together. In it's, it's, a, it's a classic piece of musical theatre. Every scene contains a genuine theatrical surprise. Every single scene. It builds and builds and builds. And it takes you to a place that no other show can. The show is operated in a sort of theatrically historical way and I think it, it has helped to maintain that that quality of the show and anything that has survived in the West End and is still going as strong as this after 27 years is worth seeing and it's worth seeing here because everybody involved in putting it yeah. on that stage 
cares about it and respects it. Absolutely, absolutely true. Here, here. Yeah, and my God, it's great music. Wonderful, wonderful music.